Hey, thank you for tuning in. Josh here with Music Maker. Thanks for watching another Music Maker guitar video. Today I'm just playing some music. Um, I'm working on, I'll get more into this later, but um, I'm currently working on actually like a class that I'm doing with uh, the amazing producer in Canty. He does uh, some really, really great like electronic music. And he's got a really great understanding of Ableton Live and how it works and sound design and um, mixing. He's, he's just a really got like a world of that kind of knowledge. So I'm just trying to deepen my knowledge on the craft here. So his assignment was to make a track and he had some kind of uh, specifications with it. He just asked for 16 bars, but I, I went ahead and made like a 32 bar kind of a loop kind of a thing with some like turn offable loops that are uh, like calls and responses and stuff but really the the goal for me was I wanted to make something that was all made with guitars you probably heard some MIDI sounds in there I want to tell you this is cool you can play things in on guitar and then convert that into MIDI so I tracked this entire track using this instrument and then just um, converting things that I played in onto into MIDI stuff. So pretty cool being able to learn how to do that, and uh, I'm hoping that I can really kind of take this to the next level over the next month or so. Um, so we'll see how it goes. Practicing a little bit every day like you do with any instrument, and I do think that um, a lot of people think about software as software. And when it comes to musical in musical recording software, like a DAW or something like that, you really do have to, if you want to make it sound right, you sort of have to play it like an instrument. And you do have to learn all the ins and outs and all the music theory that goes in with it. So it's really cool to watch him work. Uh, the way he broke it down got me seeing it a little bit more like it's just sheet music and I'm writing down the notes. So it's pretty, pretty cool to be able to just start to see it like that to understand it and make that comparison. So that said, um, I'm going to keep today's video short. I'm just making some music. It's just a first take. I'm probably going to mess with it a whole bunch, but uh, I'm just playing through my amp setup that, uh, you know, it goes three ways. Uh, the one, one is this cabinet mic'd, two is direct from the amp, and three is direct from the Boss Katana. So everything that you're hearing the one guitar that I'm playing is actually those three sounds. And I'm also playing um, two of those. This cabinet and the direct signal of the Taurus amp here is uh, also going through the H9 reverb as well as a distortion, Pictronics distortion pedal. I really just kind of love the tone of it for this track that I'm working on here. So anyways, um, that's what's going on. I'm going to go ahead and... Uh, play my way out and you have a great music monday i'll see you tomorrow technique tuesday we got a got a good one for tomorrow mm -hmm.